Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Chibuzo. On today's video, I'm going to show you guys the three herbs that I use to grow my hair. So, let's get into it. I started my hair journey last year, March. And I started with this with only two herbs that which is rosemary and cloves. So, you already know my um you already know my hair growth history my hair journey history so i don't want to talk about it on this video it's already on my youtube channel if you want to know how i started using this thing to grow my, if you want to know how i started my hair growth journey then you should watch the video it's already on my my youtube channel is everywhere all my social media is there just check it out and the purpose of this video is to show you guys what rosemary and cloves looks like. I noticed that most of my new followers, they don't know what we are doing. They don't know what rosemary looks like. They keep on asking, is rosemary time? No, rosemary is not time. It looks like time anyways, but it's not time. So I want to show you what it looks like so that you don't do the wrong thing. Like you don't use time, time, ha, wahala. Please, if you come across this video, make sure you are following me. Subscribe to my YouTube channel so you don't miss my hair growth tips. I post everywhere. TikTok, YouTube, uh, Facebook, Snap. But I post longer videos on YouTube. So make sure you are subscribing to my YouTube channel so that you don't miss any of it. So you can grow your hair long and healthy just like mine with only three hairs. Three helps, no stress, less money. Yeah. Let's start with rosemary. I have to put this thing. I have to put it here. Hmm. Hey. So that I can show you guys what rosemary looks like. So this is this is rosemary. Rosemary. Not thyme. It's not thyme. It's rosemary. So this is what it looks like. I think I I will get a better a better view on the floor. Like so, this is what rosemary looks like. We are done with this. Let's now go to the most expensive. Not that expensive, expensive, but it's expensive. Cloves is expensive. I don't know why. It's too small, but it's very expensive. So annoying. Look. This is what it looks like. But it's very expensive. Like, it's more expensive than rosemary. This rosemary is very cheap. But this. This is not even looking that nice, but it smells good. It looks like I don't know, I don't know what it looks like, but this is this is this is the uh, this is it. Looks like roots or maybe it smells good. Though, let me let me show you guys on the floor. I think get a better view on the floor. So guys, this is it. Though this is the clothes. Save this video so that when you go to the market, you show it to the market women. You mostly get them in the local market. Now let's talk about the newest addition. Um, I added hibiscus. In Nigeria, we call it um, uh, zobu. In Ghana, we call it zobolo. So I don't, I, I don't know about it growing here, but like a lot of people, when I start, I started with rosemary and cloves, what uh, cloves only. So people were commenting in the comment section that oh, I should check um, zobolo leaf, the hibiscus zobo, that it works, it works. I was like, okay, a lot of people are asking me, can I add? Um, hibiscus, can I add this? Can I add zobo? Can I? I was like, okay, let me just try it and see if it works. 
so i tried it and guys it was really good seriously to be honest it's good it gives my hair like the volume the volume like when I, I when i started using it when i added it to my rosemary and close water hair growth um mixture i noticed after i removed my mini braids i noticed the the vol i noticed as the volume has increased like it's not the way it used to like some something it added like it added like it was let's say double i don't know how to put it but like it's double like it, it doubled what he used to how he used to grow it, it doubled. These three herbs that I just showed you has made my hair journey very, very, very easy. Like, I'm loving it. They are not expensive and except cloves, which is not normal, but like, it's okay. The price is okay, but it should not be like that, but it's okay. So it has made my hair journey very, very easy. If you go through my page, you see my throwbacks. I'm not coming to add it to this video go and look for it it's on my page it's everywhere it's on my youtube channel it's on my tiktok my facebook everywhere so you all watched me grow my hair on this app so if you are doubting if you are still doubting this if you are still doubting this this treatment these herbs if you are still doubting them then i don't know i don't know what is wrong with you my apology but if you are really serious about growing your hair then you should try the rosemary and close water hair growth treatment is trusted approved and tested but remember it's not about using them i want to, I want to tell you the bitter truth the bitter truth about using them is that if you are not consistent it's not going to work if you do it once in once in a week, it's not going to work. You have to do it every day. You have to do it every morning. Mm -hmm. You have to do it like that. Be very consistent with it. Use hair products. Buy hair products. Use them. Moisturize your hair. Use it. Don't be using. If you are using only it, I don't. I don't use only the mixture. I like I said. I make my own products. I make my own hair oil, my my butter and everything. So I use I use other hair product, but like this is my my daily moisturizer. I do it every day, and it's actually working. I, I take very good care of my hair, and as you can see, very healthy and popping. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any question, please leave it. In the comment section i'll answer i'll answer or i'll make a video answering it if you don't understand anything about the rosemary and close water hair growth treatments just leave your leave leave comment for me i'll answer anyway subscribe to my youtube channel and stay with me bye